Hi everyone. You're probably wondering what does a chemical engineer do? Chemical engineers solve chemical problems and chemicals make up everything that we can see and touch. Some of the areas we work in include chemical industries, think of food, drinks, cosmetics, paints and drugs. Semiconductors, think of companies such as Intel and Micron. Oil and plastic industry, renewable energy, manufacturing, something like SpaceX and Tesla, even consulting and research and development in academia and industry. We handle the design, construction, and operations of chemical processes, working at the junction of many disciplines, including chemistry, biology, physics, and computer science. Ultimately, we are here to solve engineering problems with the goal of improving people's lives in our communities, country, and the world. For example, my research group focuses on chemical and biosensors for food safety and medical applications. Now, chemical engineering is not an easy major. In this program, you'll learn about transport phenomena, thermodynamics, and chemical kinetics, and how to apply them to practical things like reactor design, wastewater treatment, process controls, and computational methods. You will have the opportunity to apply what you learn in class to hands-on experiments in unit operation labs. What you can expect from Qi is a family-like culture. Every faculty member is dedicated to teaching and research. We care about your professional and personal success. I look forward to meeting all of you soon. Thanks. Here's some information about what it takes to be accepted into chemical and environmental engineering at the University of Arizona. Most freshmen come into the college as no major selected and they're able to choose their major in their second or third semester. No major selected students and students outside of the college have to complete an application to choose the major that they would like. You can find this application on the College of Engineering Advising webpage. Incoming students must complete Calculus 1 with a grade of a C or better. They must also complete 12 units of U of A credit in our engineering curriculum. This would include some of our math, science, and engineering courses. Students must also complete a 2.3 GPA in those courses in order to meet our advanced standing requirements. The advisors in the College of Engineering and the Chi Department are here to help you navigate. Chi is a department where even as an undergraduate student, everyone knows your name. The faculty use innovative collaborative learning methods where we work as part of teams and on our own. Knowing how to do both helps us succeed in school and in our jobs. There are several groups and clubs you can be a part of. I'm an engineering ambassador, and we represent the department by giving tours, attending special events, and working with ambassadors from other departments. Being an ambassador has helped me become much more confident about meeting new people and public speaking. Most chemical engineering students are part of the local chapter of the American Institute for Chemical Engineers, or AICHE. This club gives students opportunities to connect with industry representatives, work together on resumes and interviewing techniques, and attend the National AICHE Conference. We also have a Chemi Car Club, where students research, design, and build a cart that is propelled using a chemical reaction. Our Student Homebrew Club meets every few weeks. You don't have to be 21 to join the club, you just have to love chemistry. Chemical engineers are needed in almost every field imaginable. So the degree opens many possibilities for you after graduation. If you're interested in medicine, chemical engineering students fulfill nearly all of med school prerequisites and have a high rate of acceptance in medical school. Please contact us if you have any questions. We hope you will join us.